Vital Tees personal security, six feet seven inches tall, of all big homie. Wrestling's big score. Former AWA, WCW, WWF, ECW star. Big time evil enforcer. Bodyguard with the constant brown. It's total protection, Mr. Hughes. And he's not intimidated by superhuman size and strength. And I think he believes he can body slam this big man here. Every time I come to this jerk wire, crime infested city, I try to tell you, Porch Monkeys, the same thing. When you see total protection, walk down that aisle, you better stand up and give me some respect. I don't think he's kidding around. Now, man, a bad look on his face. Let's get down to before Mr. Hughes lays a beat down on you. I said all the talking I was going to do, I gave this boy here 30 seconds to leave the ring. You heard me tell him that, didn't you? Yeah. I said leave. So I hope you pay your insurance bill, Danielle, because you're going down with a big time scoop slam. Challenge the first individual to body slam the other will be declared the winner, Mr. Hughes, big homie, one on one. And Mr. Hughes, you talking about a man with a, a sour, constant frown all over his face. The total protection, it is the protection of Chi Town T and Big Homie versus Mr. Hughes, the hired help of Joey Roth, right here. And this is a conflict. And look at this. Mr. Hughes says he can beat him. He doesn't have anything on him. He wants to prove that he can beat him right here.
Ten falls, no submissions. All right. No pinfalls, no submissions in this one. Former AWA, WCW, WWF, ECW star who has incredible power and can throw objects and bodies around the ring with these. Mr. Hughes, still a devastating striker with knockout power in both hands and his feet. And this is a devastating individual who can end fights quickly and he has the potential to slam and destroy opponents of all shapes and sizes with a big homie with a big swinging left arm shot has put Mr. Hughes down in shocking fashion as he has to roll all the way to the outside. The brawling and the striking of big homie is significant and with one strike he managed to put Mr. Hughes down on the outside. And in any way, shape, or form, if Big Homie can hit that big boot, it could be lights out for Mr. Hughes. So he cannot underestimate anything that Big Homie does. But this is an irony because this is Joey Roth's protection versus Chi Town T's protection. And I think we were bound to see some sort of a clash between these two because, because these are the two biggest, heaviest hitters of all of Project Revolution Wrestling, that's for sure. And with a contract being on the line, there's more at stake for Mr. Hughes. I'm trying to do that. Oh, Mr. Hughes. Uh, and Stu, Johnny. He has been a bodyguard to some of the biggest stars ever in the professional wrestling scene in this past generation. From Harley Race to Chris Jericho. He has been in the ring against, like he mentioned earlier, The Undertaker, The Rock, Stone Cold, some of the best of the best with an awesome win-loss record to boot. He has trained some of the best of the future stars in the ring, not just in televised wrestling, but in addition to all of super indie wrestling, from A.R. Fox to Eat Slater, Apollo Crews, a who's who in professional wrestling, a football background as well as he hit that stinging shot right to the throat, a big homie, taking any advantage he possibly can against this six foot seven inch massive giant. Both of these men, heavyweights. But in this ring, I would even venture to say that Big Homie might have an inch or two on Mr. Hughes. One corner to the other, Big Homie landed that elbow shot and Mr. Hughes takes the fall in the middle of the ring. And again, it seems as though Big Homie is too much for Mr. Hughes to handle after all. He might be dressed to impress. He might have those sunglasses. He might have the earpieces and the suspenders, but the Big Homie can hold his own too. Both of these individuals are towering fortresses. Mr. Hughes, currently one of the head trainers of face-to-face -face wrestling as well, as he is trying to change the direction, the pace of the match to improve his chances of winning. It's not about pinfalls, it's not about submissions, it is the first to body slam the other inside of the ring, and Big Homie is holding down the fort, and there hasn't been an answer by Mr. Hughes. And on a couple of occasions in two separate decades, Mr. Hughes has been a top-ranked member of the PWI Top 500, and he does not want to be shown up here at the hands of Big Homie tonight. But you better watch out for spinning side slams or worse, power slams, choke slams, set out power bombs. Mr. Hughes has the power of the muscle, but this big homie is just big with long legs and arms. And he's going to be an awkward fortress to try to lift right here. Mr. Hughes has to do some uh, warm-ups here. He got the chest warmed up right there. I don't think Mr. Hughes' total protection was 100% ready, but now he feels as though he's fully prepared. Big Homie has a chance right here to show what he's made of. Oh, 
forget the push-up. Mr. Hughes puts a hurt into him even before he could try to advance back. And extend his arms fully to get the full repetition of that particular exercise. And forget the push-up challenge. Mr. Hughes is going to try to hurt the big homie just a little bit more before he tries to attempt to slam the big man. Quick jab right there to the jawline. And this Mr. Hughes, he can decimate you from head to toe. And look at the way he tries to choke his opponent along that metal rope. Devastating powerhouse of the ring. He has been a focal point as protection for ECW Shane Douglas as well. And man, he ran and straddled him badly on that middle rope and support. And the big homie is falling apart to pieces at the hands of Mr. Hughes. Now Mr. Hughes definitely digging that right boot straight into the trachea and the throat of this man. Mr. Hughes a powerhouse and a very strong style competitor. And has literally no limits in that ring in terms of physicality and abuse. And again, Big Holy being weakened right here on the middle rope. This is a pro wrestler with three decades of experience. And Big Holy might not be fully prepared. Look at that! Great timing right there. And Mr. Hughes has just hurt himself. And everything is in flame between his legs now. And Mr. Hughes has a very peculiar look on his face. And this is a great opportunity for the big homie if he hopes to body slam this man and retain his contract in Project Revolution Wrestling. Mr. Hughes sent from one corner to the next. Big homie with a diving splash in the corner. And Hughes bent over in pain. Can Big Homie finish what he started? Watch out! He got dragged down by his head and neck. And Mr. Hughes was more alert on that attack as Big Homie wasn't fully prepared and he lost his balance as he tried to run. Look at that! He elevated it there! He picked him up, he scoop slammed him, and that's it! Mr. Hughes has won this body slam challenge after all. Project Roth Wrestling was right in. And here he is, the winner of this one. Thank you. Protection.